Purnima, man. Say hi. So going to Petrus House uh, Medical Institute in Petrus House, and as you can see, the buildings. Our Russian team is taking us to the university. They're talking in Russian. Morphology Center. Hello everyone, welcome to Medipedia. I am here right now in Petrozavos University and right now we are standing here in front of Morphology Center wherein we have three departments, anatomy lab, histology and organs department and also a forensic lab. Let's see inside what is there. So here we see that on, a right, on, on my left side there are models where students can study using those models and then there is a skeletal system where they can see all the bones in the body. On the right side of me if you will see there are real original organs. Like for a person like me who is not a doctor, it is very difficult to see such organs like that because I've never seen that. But yes, the kind of exposure students are getting first on models and then on original organs is just immense. Like I really don't uh, see that, you know, in India, it's in, this, this is available to students in just second sem. Uh, that is first year. Uh, which is, I, I don't think so in India, it is so easily accessible. Very great exposure students are getting. If you see, this is a real cadaver, but they have done some work on it to preserve it better. They have coated it with the wax, but everything on this is absolutely real. So here we can see the students are working with the real cadavers and uh, they are just uh, looking at each thing in so detail. But the practical exposure they are getting is really immense. This is the computer level of the anatomy building. You can practice the exam here. Online exams are conducted here. You can practice the online exams or there's something, the topic you can miss in the classes. The exam will be conducted here. So this part of the building is called as pathological anatomy lab wherein students can practice their how they can see the tissues and everything in uh, this uh, machines. So we can see a student here who is already having all the samples with her and then she is studying those samples uh, in detail with her notes and everything to know what is there and what how they can find an issue in the blood or how they can detect a disease in blood samples. If you can tell how Indian students are in studies and how they respond to uh, you. <coughs> Indian students are very responsible and uh, they can learn stuff. <coughs> but uh, as usual we have a very good student and not so very good student. It depends on the uh, person. Uh, what is your message to Indian students? The message is uh, you cannot learn medicine in one time. Yes. You need to learn medicine any days uh, in system. Every day you need to learn some parts. You cannot learn whole parts in one time. Mm -hmm. Learn every day. Thank you, Dr. Pavel. So this is the room where students को ये बताया जाता है कि general ward में patients की कैसे care की जाती है। तो यहाँ पे एक robotic journal ward ready किया हुआ गया है। उनको special ये बताने के लिए कि कैसे एक journal ward में patients की take care की जाती है। इसी room में अगर आप देखेंगे back side पे एक journal ward ready किया गया है और यहीं पे उसी की पढ़ाई करवाई जाती है ऑनलाइन उनको सब कुछ दिखाया जाता है ताकि वो पूरा का पूरा अपना देख सकें कि पेशेंट्स को एक्चुअली कैसे टेक केयर किया जाता है इन थ्योरेटिकल वे एंड प्रैक्टिकल वे यहाँ पे आप देख सकते हैं यहाँ पे जो टेक केयर करने के लिए जो भी बेसिक चीज़ें ज़रूरत होती है जैसे कि ग्लूकोज या सेलिन वाटर एनी थिंग इज़ रिक्वायर्ड टू टेक केयर ऑफ द नॉर्मल पेशेंट्स 
एवरी थिंग इज कैप्ट चैनल पर आपने बहुत सारी वीडियोज़ देखी होंगी जहाँ हमने मेन वीडियो में ये सब चीज़ें बताई हुई हैं कि बारह सिमुलेशन सेंटर्स हैं और बहुत सारा प्रैक्टिकल एक्सपोजर दिया जाता है अब आपको हम खुद यहाँ पे आकर लाइव दिखा पा रहे हैं कि क्या क्या एक्सपोजर बच्चों को दिया जाता है यहाँ पर तो जैसा कि हमने बताया यहाँ पे ट्वेल्व सिमुलेशन सेंटर्स हैं तो अगर आप देखेंगे यहाँ पे विमेन केयर कैसे की जाती है प्लस वहाँ पे अगर किसी को हार्ट की प्रॉब्लम है वो कैसे टेक केयर किया जाता है बच्चों की केयर कैसे की जाती है अगर कोई एक्सीडेंटल केस है वो कैसे टेक केयर किया जाता है हर चीज़ की प्रॉपर सिमुलेटर सेंटर्स में बच्चों को गाइडेंस दिया जाती है पर ये है बच्चों के लिए कैंटीन जहाँ पे बच्चे वाइल्ड दे आर स्टडिंग आकर यहाँ पे खाना खा सकते हैं तो काफ़ी सारी ऑप्शंस बच्चों के लिए यहाँ पे अवेलेबल है